ready? Yeah. It's very early. We set off um, just after seven because we have a long journey ahead. We are ambitiously really want to get to Oxford. So we set it at Wellingford um, and I think it's about 22 plus miles to get there. It should take us about 10 and a half hours. So we are cracking on so we can get there at a reasonable time, hopefully. Yeah, there aren't many train stations between Wallingford and Oxford. Um, and obviously Mouse needs to go back to London, so we're just gonna have to do it. First look of the day. I'm not sure how many are we doing today. But I don't think I want to know. Today's trip is 23 miles and eight, um, and five furloughs, whatever five furloughs is. We've got eight blocks, we've done one, so we've got seven left to do. 10 hours and 32 minutes it should take us. What time did we leave? 7.15. 7.15. So we should get there around six. Long day. Ding, it just escaped in the lock. Two down, six to go. Is it six to go? Yeah, you said eight locks. To Did do. I? Yeah. There are eight locks to do today, and we've done two. Dried tomato, marmite truffle breakfast is amazing. So good. A lot of cruising today. Not too many locks. So nice to just have like a really long stretch of driving opposed to start, stop, start, stop, start, stop. Yeah, it's not like a canal, you're actually doing the majority of the day cruising. Yeah, definitely. It's a nice day, and it's not even, well, it's just gone to 10. So we're 
cruising. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but we've um, spent two summers on the Thames, so we already know where to go, yeah. yeah. Miles, what happened in the lock? What happened in the lock? I don't know, what did happen in the lock? nice lock keeper he was chatting to the lady in the other boat on the other side and he had sunglasses on he was looking at me and they're like holding the rope and he just like starts waving and I was like and then it was quickly realized it wasn't for me it was for some people walking behind me he didn't even notice me waving I don't think but Marina did it was hilarious <laughs> so embarrassing so then I just started waving to him a few times because I needed to get the wave back. And he waved in the end, he did wave. Oh God, you You're trying to embarrass me in front of the lock keeper. Traveling in the weather like this is a treat. The views are gorgeous and by lunchtime we made it to Abington where in the past and hopefully in the future Wilson Becks Canal was and will be joining the Thames. The low bridge is coming up, so we're lowering everything to squeeze us safely under. In the locks on the Thames, every boat should be secured with two lines, as the wash can be quite strong. I'm now at the front getting the bow line ready. So many trees in bloom, the air smells really sweet. Anywhere we look there is a blooming tree looks like that rapeseed is also flowering um, it's a very beautiful time of the year to be on the Thames as we are already in Oxford we are having lunch on the go Miles put together a whole board of bits from the fridge so we are continuing our travels without stopping I can't wait to get to Port Meadow
only one lock to go. We should be there in about half an hour. The river got a lot narrower, but it will open up um, at Port Meadow where we're heading. Just hope that our mooring is still available. We're coming up to a very low bridge. Boats that are taller than two meters, 2.3 meters can go through. Um, so we lowered our solar panels, turned over the bench. It's coming up. We're on the last leg of the journey and we have done the journey an hour and a half quicker than Canal Maps said. And we haven't been gunning it to be honest, we've just been at a leisurely cruise. Um, but yeah, we're just going through Oxford now and coming up to Port Meadow. It gets really narrow here, it looks like a canal. So it's just like, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Is it round this bend? three boats in the spot that we wanted to take. It's our favourite spot. No. It's acceptable. It's just doable. Let's see if we can double plank it. Yeah. Right, okay, see? That's it. Are we happy? Shall I turn the engine off? Yeah. We're here. Oh, I'm so glad we're here. I feel like I'm on holiday. Oh, the wind's blowing, sailing boats going by, people are swimming. Just need an ice cream. Um, phone signal's good. That's enough. That's the smell. Chill out. It is glorious. Hot meadow is like being at a seaside. So it is. 
So we've got a different spot this time and we actually really like it. It's different. So we don't mind. A really good spot. Yeah. So good to be back in Oxford. You can only appreciate its size because there's no leaves in it. Yet. We found someone on the trunk trying to blend into the tree. This is the biggest moth I've ever seen. This is also a great spot for watching rabbits. They all come out in the evening to graze and it's the best time to see them up close. Do birds wee though? I've never seen a bird do a wee. Just because he's not sad doesn't mean they don't do it. Yeah, oh well. You believe in aliens. What are you doing? I was just moving the boat a bit. We're going to get beached here, but... That's the price to pay. It's the price to pay. How is it? Is it salty enough? Um, mate, have you got salt? I do have salt. <laughs> Swan dance. Yeah, yeah. Oh, see if their heads are going to dance. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. I have a couple. Thank you all so much for watching till the very end and thank you to those who watch all our videos. We're very excited about our patron hangout this Sunday. Hope to see all of you lovely patrons on there. Sending you all our love. See you in the next one.